Welcome to RealRealm Spotlight 28. Another week has passed, and we have many information that you can't miss. In this video, we will help you go through all the essential news. Let's go. The first is news about the current normal box sale on Dare NFT. Continuously sold out in several sales, this proves the appeal of normal box and its ability to bring you profits in the game. Not stopping at Real Realm Marketplace, we hope that the opportunity to buy boxes will be spread to more people through Dare NFT. End time at April 27. Quantity 1000 boxes. Price 10 BUSD per box. At Dare Play Marketplace, you buy the Real Realm box by following the link in the picture. With only one hero NFT, you can increase your earning chances. Hurry up to own these precious normal boxes and get many benefits. Next is the news of Real Realm's latest update Real in game withdrawal fee adjustment. Specifically, the withdrawing real fee from the game account to the wallet will be adjusted according to the progressive daily fees. Let's see in the table. Starting fee is 2% on the first day of withdrawal. You will be charged at the next rates if you withdraw consecutively on day 2, day 3, etc. Until the 10th day is, the highest fee is 45%. This increasing only applies if you withdraw consecutively every day because we have the second rule. Reduce the fee to two levels if you stop withdrawing for one day. For example, you have withdrawn for five consecutive days. On the sixth day of withdrawal, the fee is calculated at level six. Day seven, you stop withdrawing. Then the withdrawal on day eight, the fee will be calculated at level 4. Reduce two levels compared to day 6. Rule 3. The highest fee is level 10. 41%. That is, even if you withdraw continuously on day 11 or more, the fee is still 41%. In summary, if you withdraw consecutively, the fee will increase. If you stop for one day, the fee will drop to two levels. Please note this information carefully to make a reasonable decision to withdraw real. Next, we just announced the Hero NFT's EXP point required scoreboard for each level and each orb 4. To be able to surpass one orb, we need to pass 10 levels. To pass a level, the hero needs enough experience points. In the table is the total EXP through each level of each orb. Starting at level 1 orb 1, hero will have to accumulate EXP through wins in PvE Earn NFT mode. Level 10 Orb 5 is the highest level achieved by a hero, with a total EXP of 324,000. In short, this is the total EXP needed to overcome each orb. 8,100 EXP for surpassing Orb 1, over 37,000 EXP for Orb 2, etc. And finally, 324,000 EXP to reach the max of Orb 5. Another way to get EXP points without winning the battles. That is burn one or more hero NFTs to convert EXP points. We have shown you this way before. The EXP that hero upgrade receives will depend on the LTV and the EXP point of hero material. According to the formula in the picture, if your hero upgrade is under Orb 5, we will use the formula in the above row. If hero upgrade is Orb 5 or higher, we will use the formula of the bottom row. For more details, we will attach the link below. Please take a look to arrange a reasonable playing strategy and upgrade hero. Finally, information about periodic token burning. This April, Real Realm burned 11,111,111 tokens. This is the most significant amount of real burn ever. These real tokens come from selling diamonds to gaming users trading fees on marketplace and all real collected from all normal box sales at real realm marketplace until april 19th that's why the real token was burned up to more than 11 million tokens this time burning real is a crucial mechanism to reduce inflation and help keep token prices stable the 28th spotlight is now in thank you for watching until the end of the clip all the information in today's spotlight is showed in the description Please review if you do not apprehend. Don't forget to follow Real Realm on the channels below. Thank you so much. See you in the next Spotlight video.